his head and well he might can't kill Clyde so nearly found a way through that I was warned yesterday by the Coventry management to watch out for kill Klein at set pieces Came off the post I think in fact there it's not over yet it's Gibson with Roberts still Gibson now for Regis Cyril Regis, right on the stroke of the final whistle, has done it for Coventry. Gibson set it up, sending two defenders the wrong way, and the left foot finished splendidly. Oh, what a finish here. Only his second goal for the club, and what an important one it's turning out to be, and some of the Tottenham fans behind the goal and come onto the field over on the far side why oh why do they have to spoil it it's been an enjoyable competitive game and we really can't do without scenes like this the play can't go on while they're on the field Cyril Regis takes a deep breath and at last the power was there for the man who for so long was regarded as the top centre forward around and he started off oh, at the post well how did Coventry survive there so here's the free kick again then from Hoddle and it's Falco there who climbs highest off the post and Allen fails to score, so does Miller, and somehow it scrambled away for a corner. And there goes the final whistle now. What a finale to the game.